Aloha, friends. We are so excited because where are we going this week, Kai? Uh, we're going to the Bahamas. The bah we're going on the low carb cruise, but mm -hmm. I want to ask who's going to KetoCon, Hack Your Health, whatever it's called now. Hack Your Health, KetoCon, because if you were there the last time I was there, what did I throw in the audience? Do you remember, Kai? You threw uh, my Hawaiian rolls. Yeah, yeah. And I'm going to make them for you right now. Yep. So whether you get to go to Hack Your Health and you can catch one of them or you want to make them at home, you are going to want... What are you eating, Kai? We made Cheetos. Cheetos. Egg whites mm -hmm. and cheddar cheese. Like, you got to try those. So go for it, Kai. I have the oven on at 325. But if you yeah. want to make these today, these Hawaiian rolls are really great for a burger. Is that what you ate today? Yeah. A patty melt, right? Yeah. So I use the protein bread, the carnival bread. But this is what you're going to want. You want to want eight, eight eggs. Now, you can either use a stand mixer or you could use a hand mixer, whatever you want. But you want to separate them. You want to do that with me? Yeah. Make sure no yolks get into this bowl. You can put the yolks in here, right. put the whites in here. So the whites go in here, Kai. This is going to be tricky. If I, I don't want to get it on your hands. Yikes. Has anybody made the... Oh, I got a yolk in there. Dude. Uh oh Here, I'll get a, grab a new egg. Did you... Yikes. If you get a yolk in there, it's not that we're afraid of yolks, but um, it's going to... You got to move your hand. You got to get the yolk out. The whites... <laughs> the whites won't whip. I think we should start over, dude. Where do we put this? I think we need to get a new bowl. Put it in here. Yeah. Let's get in. Can you grab another bowl and two more eggs? Yep. Because if you get any yolks in there, they just won't whip right. And you can use 100% egg whites, but they don't tend to get as stiff. They're going to be a flatter bun. So what I use with this, all the extra yolks, make scrambled eggs. Perfect, Kaya. Either one. Okay. So now we need two more eggs. So right behind me. Um, I'm going to put the whites into a bowl before I put in the sand mixer because... Man, my hair looks like wild today. Um, the stand mixer, if you put it in there, it'd be harder to clean it and do all the things. Right, there we go. You want to help me? Yeah. Kai's really good at cracking eggs. Do you know what yesterday was? You want to tell everybody what yesterday was? Okay, yesterday we our went up. Our anniversary. Yeah, our anniversary. Our adoption anniversary. I posted a little video if you didn't see that. It was cute. What are you doing? You can't just smash the egg. Now you don't have any whites in there. Now you have a yolk in there again. Mama Mia, this is supposed to be like a quick video. I'm going to get that out. Okay. <laughs> we need another egg. We're wasting a lot of eggs. These are from the neighbor too. Can we get another egg? So you want egg, egg eight egg whites. Right behind me. Yeah, you got it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And then what you're going to want is a fourth of a cup of allulose. Now, if you want to skip that, you can, but it makes a really nice crust on the outside. And let me tell you. There's a carnivore guy on YouTube that said, my bread tastes like styrofoam. Dude, what is going on, guy? Sorry about that. We have a really full bowl. I'm going to need another bowl here. Um, he said it tastes like styrofoam. I was not a fan of him. Anyway, here we go. Can you slide that bowl closer to me? Uh, um, this bowl. Yeah, because I'm out of... That's full. There we go. We could have put it in. Now, with the yolks, I posted a YouTube video on all the things I do with the extra yolks. Um, I make ice cream with it. I make my... Cheetos? Keto, well, we need uh, whites for that. Oh, um, yeah. I make hollandaise with it, mayonnaise, bernays. Um, but mainly, I'll get this, these egg whites and make uh, scrambled eggs with them. Okay, so now we have our egg whites. Kai, can you put that into the stand mixer? Yikes, we got a lot of mess. Ooh, maybe I should have done that. Okay, stand mixer, and we're going to season it with our Redmond Real Salt. Love that. The reason I like Redmond, there's no microplastics. Everybody's afraid of microplastics now. Mm -hmm. It's good stuff. We're going to add a fourth of a cup of allulose on in here. How are those Cheetos, Kai? Good. Good. Oh, I'm going to show you another trick, too. And then we're going to add a half a cup of dried egg whites. Now, you can make your own dried egg whites, or you can just buy them online. It's just dried egg whites. That's all you want. And I think if forgetting anything, no, no, I'm going to whip them. I have some pineapple extract for later, but I'm going to whip this on high. Kai, show them the Cheetos. Okay, so this is uh, the Cheetos that we made. Uh, we have multiple. You like them? Yeah, they're really good. <laughs> uh, and comment below and I'll send you the link to it, <laughs> the recipe. Yeah. So 
Yeah, they're good. Jot, jot them down. Jot them down. This will be on our YouTube. On our YouTube? It'll yeah. be on, uh, I think I'll post it on here tomorrow. Yeah. It's on our YouTube already. It's an old video. So, once this is whipped, oven's on at 325, you're going to want to pan like this. Move ties Cheetos over here. And I'm going to spray that with some spray. Just a light leaf. And you're going to want this. It's almost ready. It's almost ready. But this is an ice cream scooper. It's going to make perfect buns. But instead of spraying it, I'm going to grease it with some of my tallow. I love that stuff. Good stuff. Where's the... This, yeah? Ah. Just rim that nice. This makes really great videos. <laughs> Too loud. And then, if you want to make it Hawaiian, you could add a little bit of pineapple extract. I like this kind. I didn't add any cream of tartar, did I? Oh, man. We forgot this. Yeah. Mama mia. I'm getting stuff in my hair. Okay, this is cream of tartar. It's optional, but it helps stabilize the whites, okay? We didn't use it, so it's fine. Okay, so now, this is pretty whipped, don't you think? Yeah. Now, most people under whip it, but you want it to look like marshmallow. I was gonna use a clear bowl, but marshmallows, like really fluffy, okay? And what we're gonna do is get it out of this. Oh boy. It's hard to do this in a video. I really don't like doing videos most of the time. Get all of that off because all that goodness is going to go to making you guys some really good things. Now, what I did, I don't know if you heard me, I rimmed it with this tallow because if you use the spray, why are you eating that? Not bad. <sighs> He's eating this. Mamma mia. Oh, I didn't add the pineapple. Should I add oh. the pineapple or no? Sure. Sometimes adding a little bit of liquid to these whites cause them to not, they kind of fall. A little bit of that. Okay, and then I'll mix it with the... Where did uh, that spatula go? Spatula. I have it right here. Huh. Did you move Wait, it? Wait, no. Oh, it's, it's right here. There. It's underneath it. Yeah. So just mix that up. And again, it's, make sure it still stays like really fluffy, okay? Now, no, no, no. I'm going to use the ice cream scooper. I know you wish we made ice cream. And then you plop it right down. Look at that. Ooh. So funny story, okay? Your grandma and grandpa, Grandma Nancy, used to take me to Florina's. Florina's was a restaurant in Medford, Wisconsin, and they had butter that looked like this. And I thought it was ice cream. My sister told me it was ice cream. And so I ate it and I was like, oh, it's butter. I was so disappointed. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so we're gonna make a nice stack of these. You can see them. Don't they look beautiful, everybody? And then we're gonna bake them for about, I don't know, 15 minutes until they're golden brown. If you do not add the allulose, they're not gonna get golden brown. But if you add it, it will turn golden brown. All right, so these are what I'm gonna throw. Uh, here, I should be clear, these freeze great, okay? I am going right from the cruise to KetoCon. Yeah, so I have to put these in the freezer and Craig We'll take them out of the freezer and bring them to Hack Your Health KetoCon. And then I will throw them on Sunday. And I hope you catch one of them. I'm very excited to do that. And then after Hack Your Health, mm -hmm. we fly home for one day and then we leave for uh, France. Yeah. Yeah. So it, I have like three suitcases all packed and ready to go. So if I'm a little uh, tired when I see you, Please know that I am super excited to meet all of you. Um, what are you most excited for, Kai? Probably the cruise or Hack Your Health? Uh, the cruise. The cruise. I knew it. I knew it. I'm going to put one over here. Ta-da. So these are the buns. Awesome blossom. And uh, if you come to Hack Your Health, you could uh, uh, so come say hi. You'll be there. Yeah. You'll be there. And uh, what do you want to tell people? Uh, cook with your kids. Cook with your kids. And comment below. We'll send you the link to the... Uh, recipe uh, for yeah. Cheetos, Cheetos or the Hawaiian rolls. And they don't taste like styrofoam. So that carnivore guy, go away. Yeah. 
Mahalo, everybody. I'm just kidding. Mahalo. I'm kidding. They're not styrofoam.